As well as a place to live, Ashby is also a place of work, offering a variety of jobs and careers to local people, from retail, catering and hospitality, to education, healthcare, the leisure and tourism industry, construction and road work, farming, to financial services, and a range of other local businesses. Ashby is surrounded by a number of business and industrial parks. Some of the older ones, like these on the Ivanhoe Industrial Estate, have been here a long time. But right next door, the brand new Ivanhoe Business Park is just starting to develop. Soon, all these open spaces will be filled with busy working units and offices. Probably the oldest existing industrial site in the town is here at the Standard Soap Factory. Soap has been made here for over a hundred years and before that the site was a glue factory and a leather works. Its state-of-the-art production lines are still providing work for Ashby people today, making a range of soaps and soap products which are distributed all over the country. They can also be bought locally in the company's own factory shop. For many years, Ashby has been associated in the minds of many with biscuit making. Today there is a housing estate where the biscuit factory once stood. However, the names of the one-time owners lives on in some of the new street names and further up the road, its sister factory, KP, is still producing a range of snack foods. On the opposite side of the road stands another well-established local industry. Ashby has had a dairy on this site for decades. Once a private firm called Ivanhoe Dairies, it was taken over first by Northern Dairies in the 1960s and then by Express Dairies and now belongs to Arla Food UK. We came here to talk to Len Eaton, Works Manager, about the business. So how long have you worked here then? Uh, 30 years. 30 years? The dairy itself employs 260 people, many from Ashby, and a further 200 work in the distribution centre. The dairy plant receives milk from all over the UK which is processed here before being distributed to supermarkets and other outlets around the country. On the other side of town, the original Nottingham Road industrial site is still home to the Pickachick Chicken Processing Company and behind it stand some of the older warehouse and distribution units. But this site too has now expanded into a smart business park with attractive, stylish office buildings and household names such as Siemens. Our last port of call on this tour of Ashby's business parks is here at Flagstaff, which is dominated by the huge United Biscuits distribution centre and associated offices. But it's also home to Ashfield into Focus. This leading healthcare company has chosen Ashby as the location for its state-of-the-art training and conference centre, Ashfield House. So, with all these opportunities, Ashby is a good place to live and work.